Close your eyes and watch your breath. Make the breath as comfortable as you can. Try for a while to see what kind of breathing actually feels best. Does long breathing feel good now, or would shorter breathing feel better? How about heavier or lighter, faster, slower? Try to adjust things so it feels just right inside. You're creating a good place for the mind. All too often we hope, and we hope that the good place for the mind will have been made for us by other people, things outside, other people saying nice things, doing nice things to us. But you have to face up to the fact that the world's not like that. There's gain and there's loss. The people who like you and people who don't like you. People who praise you, people who criticize you. So you can't let your well-being inside depend on things outside, because the outside is a pretty rough road, up and down. To go more smoothly, you have to learn how to put yourself in a good mood when things are going well and when things are going bad. A good mood here doesn't mean just necessarily feeling good. It also means the right mood to look and see what's the most skillful thing to do right now. Because when things are going well, you tend to get complacent. When things are not going well, you tend to get upset. But you have to learn how not to get complacent, because when things go well, here's your opportunity to do some good. It's not there just to make you feel happy. It's an opportunity to do good. So what good can you do when p things are going well? And when things are not going well, you can say, okay, this is what the world is. You have to learn how to find your own resources inside. And when a person can find resources inside, that means you're a lot more likely to be able to live in the world and not suffer, and not cause suffering for other people. So learn how to smooth out your ride here. So the bumps up don't jolt you, and the, the holes in the road don't get you stopped. You're able, able to keep things on an even keel inside. A sense of well-being, a sense of ease inside. And that way you can live anywhere, and the mind doesn't have to be damaged, the mind doesn't, doesn't have to suffer. So try to develop this skill inside. Learning how to warn yourself when you're trying to when you're beginning to get complacent, and learning how to lift your spirits when things outside are down. That way you can protect yourself, and as the Buddha said, that way you become your own refuge. There's nobody else who can do these things for you. You're the one who has to learn how to do them yourself. <laughs>